Hi everybody. So today, it's a beautiful Sunday. I hope everybody's having a nice day. I wanted to talk a little bit about low frequencies and high frequencies and digital slander. <laughs> First of all, I've noticed, and this is part of the whole acceleration of time and movement toward part of the things the Mayan calendar talked about also, was this spiraling up of energy and frequency, which means that a lot of low vibrational stuff is going to come up. So I've noticed over the last few months, people are really getting hit with a lot of low frequency things happening to them. And on YouTube, if you make videos or if you've got yourself out there in any public way, you know, you can become a target. And it seems like the low frequencies have just consumed a lot of video time lately on uh, YouTube. And, it, and it's maybe a great sign that we're all supposed to get off of YouTube and go someplace else. Unfortunately, and to everybody that's written me over at Zipcast, I am so trying to get back to everybody, but as you know, it's, it's such a cumbersome thing to do. It takes so long to just reply. So thank you. I'm trying to get to everybody, just so you know, um, not ignoring. So uh, what else is I going to talk about? The low frequencies. Well, the best way to deal with low frequencies is to raise above them and laugh. And um, <clears throat> just try and not let the scum stick to you, right? And in life, it's the same thing. You're gonna run up, you know, sh you know, cruddy bosses, bad neighbors, and the best thing you can do is just try and spend as little time as possible with bad energy and move yourself over into good energy, good people, good vibes. But on a whole other level, let's talk about the law now, okay? Uh, digital slander is punishable. You can get sued for it. Uh, I'll leave the civil code underneath so you know you in California are not allowed to use anybody's likeness or picture in any way, in any manner, for whatever reason if they don't want you to. Especially if it's in some way uh, demeaning them or bullying them or slandering them. Okay? This is something you can go to jail for in California, and you can also lose a lot of money if the person wants to sue you. And they will win, obviously, because if you've stolen their image, it is showing up someplace on the internet. Uh, well, there's the proof. So um, what you may or may not know is that even if you don't live in California, you think, hey, this doesn't apply to me. I can go out and demean or bully people. Uh, the fact is, if you're doing it on YouTube, it does apply to you because all the YouTube servers are in California. Therefore, you are under the jurisdiction of California. In fact, if you do get sued by somebody on YouTube, you are going to have to come to California for that suit. So, I happen to already be here and uh, you know so maybe I'll be seeing some of you because it seems like sadly a lot of people are spending their energy just trying to hurt other people and uh, you know that's not a good thing folks I mean shit we want peace on earth but we're gonna attack each other and you know everybody on YouTube is a person all those people behind those names even if they don't have a picture they're people and you know I say we just got to be nicer to each other, people. Come on now. Let's just step up. And even if we don't agree, that's okay. I, for one, like it when people disagree with me. If they have some something they can teach me because I like to learn. It's just like, you know, yeah, nobody likes to be wrong. But if you can give me better knowledge, that just ends up helping me in the long run. I think that's the best thing about you two. But, I mean, if people are going to be rude and mean and condescending, it's just like your channel's your party. You can... You can send anyone home you want because who wants a bunch of bad vibes at your party? So anyway, I'd love your comments and everybody have a great Sunday.